The last misunderstanding is that transit traffic is still responsible for most connections. Uh, transit traffic has a tendency to be expensive. And of course, this is where some of those arguments now start resonating and explain this, this relationship that needs to be uh, rethought between telecom operators and platforms. However, um, according to recent studies, we are seeing that this is really not the case as well. And there is a major shift from transit to peering traffic. And if you don't mind, I would like to take a couple of moments here, a couple of minutes to, to just go a little bit deeper on that, because it really goes back to the first point, how the internet is very different from um, the, a telephone network. So the telecom operators are absolutely correct when they are stating that internet traffic has increased over the years. What they fail to mention, I feel, is the fact that because of that, they had to become more and more creative. And the internet has allowed them to do that. So what's happening right now? So as ISPs deal with volumes of traffic, um, it is more efficient for them to start creating direct peering connections rather than sending uh, the traffic up their transit providers. Uh, and the advantage that peering has is that it decreases the load as well as the cost of the transit service and leads to better performance. So in this increasing complexity and in order to survive this increasing complexity, ISPs are constantly involved in substantial amounts of traffic engineering. Essentially, these are management decisions that allow them to allocate traffic to the different paths that they control. Those traffic engineering techniques are generally used to keep traffic ratios, uh, peering traffic ratios, sorry, within balance and for cost efficiency. Mm -hmm. And this, all that thing is a direct outcome of the meshing of the internet. And it is what has provided really, um, uh, what has allowed better yet telecom operators, the, the ability to enter into those bilateral agreements on how to exchange traffic. So the, the reality is that uh, in today's internet, the vast majority of content uh, consumed by end users is available by peering the major content provider.